Hi guys, so hope you all are okay. I'm not so good, but anyway, <clears throat> I went shopping. Yeah, because I've been in a funk and better to do when shop when you're in a funk, okay? Yeah. Uh, so, just want to share with you what I picked up. So, I went to Walmart first this morning and I got some food items which I already put them away in the kitchen, so I'm not going to share that. However, there are two things I want to share from the food items section of my shopping this morning. And that's this. Oh, I love Velveeta cheese. Do you? I love Velveeta. I'm going to make ground beef and put the cheese in it. Mm, yum. A little trick I learned when I lived in St. Louis. An ex of mine used to do that. I used to thought, eh, but I actually did like it. So, and the best one, this melts awesomely when you cook it. So, is this a word as awesomely? Anyway, if it's not, I just coined one. So, Velveeta, I bought, what was that? I swear, this house is crying. Anywho, I know there's no one in there, so, hey. So, <laughs> this is freaky. Okay. Alrighty, so much for being distracted. So I found this. It says all natural peanut butter from, all natural from the peanut butter company. It's white chocolate wonderful. That's what it says. And I'm going to try this. My daughter likes peanut butter, finally. And I thought, because I have people who like chocolate in this house and two like peanut butter, that would be a nice thing to try. I thought it was pretty expensive for um, a one pound jar of peanut butter. It was $3 and change in Walmart, whatever. But I'm going to try it. Okay, so also Walmart, I pick up stuff for the cats. I said cats, yeah. I have two babies. I have Lorelei and I have Zuli. Zuli belongs to my daughter, Lorelei belongs to me. Come here, girl. Come here, mommy. Come here. Come here. Come here, darling. Come, come. She's not wanting to be picked up right now. Anyway, I was going to... Anyway, what? You want to see her? There she goes. Where's she at? Hey! There she goes. See her? Wagging the tail. Yep. That's my Lorelei. So, kind of like the name Lorelei. So I changed her name from Jewel to, Lo to Lorelai because oh, I could want it to. Anyway, back to the buying stuff. So I went to Walgreens again the other day. And, oops, I forgot something. I have to go get those. And um, I found Amlactin Moisturizing Body Lotion. And this was on clearance for $3.99. It's really moisturizing. So I got that. I also picked up Nature's Bounty Collagen, and this one was 13, no, if it's not, it's between 10 and $13, and it was buy one, no, it wasn't Walgreens, it was CVS, this one, CVS, $10 and change it was, and it was buy one and get one free, so I got two. I think Walgreens has it for $13.99 and I paid $10.99. Got one. Okay. So, one second. Okay. So, I'm back. So, at Walgreens, I also found, and this was last week, I found this Kashana Blush 
It says number two, pretty in pink. Kashana. Excuse my nails, guys. I painted them yesterday, and today they're all, like, chipped off. And that's that one. It's pretty. It has, like, gold reflects in it, and you can see where I swatched it. It's so pretty. That's it on the back of my hand. There. Uh, this was $3.99. This is another Kashana blush in tangerine. And that's a tangerine one. It comes with a little, you know, those little brushes you get right here that you don't really use and you don't care for because it's cheap brush and it's crap and you're not going to scratch your face with it. Yeah. So this is tangerine. You can see the pink one next to it. And that's tangerine on the back of my hand. I love that one. I also found a bronzer in Copacabana. It says number one. Copacabana was the lightest one. The others were super dark. And it's a gold. There. It's pretty. I think I want to use this as an eyeshadow. Look at that. I think I am going to use it as an eyeshadow. Okay. So, you just stop running, just like running away every time. Would you leave Zuli alone? Don't pester her. So they keep me company while my daughter is at summer camp. Yeah. Okay, so between Walgreens and CVS, and some of you who has watched my video before would know this, that I've been on a kick when it comes to these Revlon... Just bitten, blah, 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 bombs. It's kind of a mouthful, so I don't care. Okay, so actually I have eight of these. Two of them are in my pocketbook. Pocketbook is over there, ain't going over there. But the only one that I don't like, because it's a bit too light for me, would be... One second. Charm. Charm would be the only one that I don't really necessarily care for because it just doesn't, it just blends right into me, kind of deal. So that's Charm, that's Smitten. This one is Darling. This one is Sweetheart. And this one is Romantic. And rendezvous. Pretty, I tell ya. Okay, so on to the next things. I bought some liners, but I didn't bring them out. This I got with something I bought from the, the, the mall, and believe me, I aim to do a, a review on it because I think it's crap. Yeah, I said it. Some of you might not agree because it's Benefit, and Benefit is said to be... Yeah. I just think this mascara is crap. I don't get it. Um, it does nothing for me. Is no, I don't know what the hula la. And I wanted this mascara so badly because I heard so many things about it, but I don't like it. Anywho, good thing it was a gift with purchased. La la la. Okay, I picked up Tutti Frutti, the Revlon lip butter. That's Tutti Frutti. Some of you may know this already. And. Customize from Revlon. I have two of these because I paid like two dollars and change on clearance. Had to get another one. Uh, picked up this new Volume Express Mousse Mega Plush. Hate it. Okay, on to the other good stuff. So while I was in Walmart today. Those were like over the course of the last maybe week or two, three weeks more. I picked up Rimmel's Candle Eyes. I'll try that. I also picked up Milani's Runway Lashes in Extreme Black. Let's see what that is like. So on my way home, I stopped at Walgreens again. 
And L'Oreal, I think this is a new color because I had never seen this with the original ones that came out. And the Infallible Eyeshadow is 800 Bottomless Java. It's just a really deep, rich brown. I love this. Look at that. And it has like specks of gold in it. That's just like, just awesomeness just waiting to happen on my eyelids. You know what I mean? Yeah. Then they also had glist Glistening Garnet. And let me show you what that one looks like. And that's Glistening Garnet. It, isn't it pretty? Yeah, I like. I do also have some more of these. There's two that I bought at Walmart last week, but they're in there. And now, if you follow me on Twitter, y'all will know that I tweeted while I was in Walgreens. Bam! I found the L'Oreal BB Cream. I hated the Garnier one. For those of you who it works for and you like it, kudos to you. By all means, love it, enjoy it, whatever. I didn't. I was greasy. It just slid off my face. I, I felt yucky. Um, is there another word I can use in the English dictionary to describe how disgusted I was by that thing? Possibly, but I won't hollow them up. Anywho, I returned it because I paid... I think this is a dollar more. This one was $13.99, plus I got coupons off. The young lady at the register, she figured, I'm always shopping, blah, 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 and da, 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 and she had L'Oreal coupons, so I got coupon off this one. I also found the Magic. This one I tried in the store, and I loved it. But, this one I haven't tried yet. So this is what it is. And I got it in medium, of course. Ooh, that looks nice. I'm gonna put it a little teeny bit on my hand. That's the medium. Oh, it blend right in. Look at that. <gasps> Ooh, okay. I tried this one in the store, it was in light. And look, it comes out white. And I rubbed it in, and look at that. It's taking on, it's taking on, it's taking on. Oh. The light one rubbed in and took on my skin, so I took the medium, and look at that. And my face is actually, of course, lighter than my hand. So, look at that. Oh, my goodness. They both have a little bit of citrus. Oh, this one has, the BB cream has a citrus scent to it, similar to the, um, the Garnier one. But we'll see how the scent and I work out. For future reference. So the last thing I'll show you guys is this. <laughs> yeah, I bought two of them for my two girls. Uh, I'm gonna tell you how it works. I already opened one, and I'll do a review. You know, after it's in use, just telling you how it is and da 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 da. But it's called the Lift and Sift. And I was looking to see if I see any reviews on it, but unfortunately, not. So I'll, for all you cat lovers out there who may be interested and don't want to sift kitty poop, you know, I'll let you know how it works out for me. Because I'm not supposed to be playing with cat poop. So I need something that, you know, less contact, mean, scoop, no. Mm -mm. We do that for babies. Real babies. Anyway. <laughs> Thank you for watching guys appreciate your time and I may have forgotten to share a few other things with you but I'm almost at 10 minutes and I think I have 15 minutes maximum because my first channel is deleted blah 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 so I'm out of here bye thanks for watching have a good day